you got to start somewhere. And if you're not happy where you want to be right now, I'm here to tell you that the journey is way more important than the final destination. Because the journey is the only thing that's going to make you appreciate it even more when you do make it where you want to make it. And also, at the same time, if it was so easy, everybody will be doing it. What we know to everybody watching this video, um, I didn't want to just um, make that first part of the video and never put anything like to add some type of substance to the entire video. So I wanted to talk about um, something that is related to what I said in the first part of this video. So basically I wanted to talk about this picture. You're probably seeing the picture on the screen right now. This picture was one of the first pictures I took uh, kind of you know, semi-professionally because I was a beginner at the time, but one of the first pictures I took and you're watching this picture and you probably think that I had all the lighting and all those different stuff at that particular moment, but I did not. So I wanted to put this picture here because I wanted to kind of break down um, as to where I started because like I said, that was in the beginning. So I wanted to break down this picture a bit. You might be probably looking at the orange background. Well, this orange background, some people might think it's a seamless background, which is the normal background that I use now, but that's actually an orange curtain. At that time, I was going to school, we couldn't really afford that much, so the curtain had to do. So we went to Ikea because I was work, I was living in the uh, Netherlands at the time, so we walked to Ikea. I looked for the smallest orange curtain that I can find, and at the same time, I looked for um, small little pins because that isn't really nothing I have to hang on to. I took my sofa at the time that I had inside of my um, small little studio apartment, which was like a container, but <laughs> that's for another time. But I took my um, couch and it was an L couch. So I turned it up on the side so that the L is kind of standing up. I took the curtain, stretched it as much as possible onto the L part because if you leave it hang a little bit, then you start to see creases and which will make it more difficult for me to do in the post processing of the image. So I took it, I stretched it out, pinned them to the, um, pinned them to the sofa. And that sofa now probably had a lot of holes in the bottom of it, but hey, that's beside the story. I had to just do what I do. And at that time, I just used the lens that the camera came with. I didn't use nothing fancy. Um, you know, nowadays people say, don't use the lens where the camera comes with, or just buy the, the camera with the body alone and buy a lens after. But at that time, I didn't know any of those stuff, but so that's what I did. And yeah, it, um, that is what is one of my favorite pictures. And it couldn't be my favorite picture because it's tied to kind of tied to my story. But at the same time, I really like the picture and how it came out, even though I had the minimal amount of equipment. So I say all of that just to say that not all the time you're going to have everything that you need to have. And all of that is part of the journey. Like I explained in the beginning, you have to start somewhere in order to make it to where you are. And usually you fall in love with the journey more than the final destination or you never even have a final destination because you're so in love with your craft, you just keep on doing what you're doing and you never reach to an end goal, which always, that is what also always keep you um, inspiration, like you wanna, you keep you inspired then, let me say. So I really wanted to bring that story across because maybe some people might think I just started in a specific place, but I was a student, wasn't getting much money, just living in a small studio apartment that is the size of a 20 foot container and I want to tell you, just appreciate the journey because you're going to get to the place you want to get to eventually. So I hope you guys enjoy that story. Um, I'm going to do a lot of these with when I do um, different things in the front just to add on like I did with the first video. And yeah, like I say on Jackie Imagery, capture the moment, watch it forever, bless. See you guys in the next video next week.